guys, welcome back to Princess Stars UK and today is our christening. Today is the 18th of February and today is our christening. And today my best friend is coming. <laughs> yes, I'm a rock star. Shall we say hi? Look. <laughs> Today is a very big day for our girls. Princess Tyler, Princess Isla and Princess Rose is getting christened today. Look how beautiful you two look. Absolutely gorgeous. And little Charlotte Rose. Charlotte, say tickle tickle. Ready, set, go. Go again. Say tickle tickle. <laughs> tickle tickle. Tickle tickle. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> we have now arrived at St. Mark's Church.
what is baptism about? In our service, we use different symbols. So a bit later on, we use the symbol of the cross, which is the sign of Jesus. We also have the symbol of light. I'll come to that later on as well. But the main symbol we use is water. And there's three things I want you to think about when it comes to water, but I need some help first. Brooke, one thing you never do in a church is look the vicar in the eye. <laughs> because then they walk over to you and they start asking you questions. And they'll say, Brooke, can you answer me a question? And you'll say, yes. Yes. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> and then I'll say, Brooke, what do you do with water? And you'll say to me, drink it. How do you do? Imogen drinks it? Yeah? What would you do with water? I'll come to you and say. Shall I ask somebody else? <laughs> What's going to happen now is no, everyone's looking at the shoes now. No one's looking in the eye. That's, that's the other one. Apart from you, sir. Sorry, you just caught me there. <laughs> sir? Drink it. Drink it. No, you've already had that, can't I? Um, wash. Wash. Do you? Yeah. Good. Um, <laughs> okay, so we've got drink, we've got wash. Anything else you do with water? Cook. You cook. I'm trying to do something theological with this. So we, we can cook, we can water, we can use it to mix, we can drink, we can wash in it. Water is very important, isn't it? Water is a very important thing. We need water probably more than anything else uh, in this world to live. Water, in a sense, is the stuff of life. And thankfully, Imogen drinks water. <laughs> Do you? Yeah. People, children, adults into God's family. And there's a promise of an eternal life. A life that goes beyond this life. So when we baptise, we baptise remembering a promise of an eternal life for God's children. So baptism is about life. Now the second one, say what's your name? Uh, Austin. Austin. Austin's had a wash today. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> Brooke. <laughs> Anybody else had a wash today? Four of you? Me. <laughs> it's just your family and friends. Yeah. I hope you have had a wash. <laughs> you have to wash, don't you? you? You work, you play, you do all the things you do. You get dirty, your body gets dirty, your clothes get dirty. And you wash, and hopefully water is used in the process of washing. It makes us clean. In baptism, we think of a different way in which we need to be clean. And it's this word sin, it's only a small word. But it's the things that we do, that we say, that we think, that we know are wrong, and that often hurt other people. It sort of makes us unclean. Baptism is a reminder of a God who loves us, a God who promises life, but also promises to forgive us. Some people, a lot wiser than me, once said the greatest need we have in this world is to be forgiven. And so baptism is a reminder of a God who forgives. Whenever we do anything wrong, we have a promise that God will forgive us. And yes, we need to be sorry. We need to use the word repent. But God can make us clean. So baptism is about life. Baptism is about making us clean. I haven't found anything yet for the garden. Trying to get. <laughs> no! Anybody into football? Me! Me! Again, is this your family and friends? <laughs> thank you, thank you. Hello. Okay, for those who are you know, Cristiano Ronaldo, we know Cristiano Ronaldo. So imagine Cristiano running down the wing and he beats one guy, he beats a second guy, he beats a third guy, he's going to be in party. He comes back, does it all. That's quite good, isn't it? Now, I'm not happy. Is it, oh, I was going to just wander down here. So this is Charlotte Rose. This is the latest member of God's family. Charlotte Rose, this is your family and friends. You can't choose and can you? Yeah. I'm going to just wander down here. And people are going to go, oh. <laughs> And they're going to wave and say, hello. <laughs> and you're going to go that way. Oh, she's going to make us very poor because we're their grandparents. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Hello. 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 Hello.
do a little backwards and just go see. There we go. Gorgeous. Yeah, well, good girl. Yeah. Well done, good girl. Okay. In a moment, I'm going to pick up your sisters in the same way. <laughs> <laughs> your eyes because you've got mascara on. <laughs> you should get the type that, did, that doesn't run. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go on. It's okay, we have wind marks. Okay. <laughs> Imogen, oh not too big, I need to get your head. Yeah. Imogen Tyler, just keep them. I baptize the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Guys, oh. 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 So, honestly, it won't run that much. Just looks like you're happy. That's okay. That's okay. Do you want to come this way? You want to come stand at the front here. And this is now the latest, latest member of God's family. This is this is Imogen. Imogen, this is your family and friends. Hello. Hello. Say hello. They're gonna say hello back. Yeah. Do you want to wander down and come back again? Look as if you're enjoying it. <laughs> Yay! Oh, and you want to come back up? Fantastic. Craig. 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 She needs some support. <laughs> Say this uh, next to you. There is one Lord and one faith and one baptism. Charlotte and Brooke and Imogen mm. are the one spirit we're all baptized into one body. And if we can, we say together in the scriptures, we welcome you into the fellowship of faith. We are children of the same heavenly father. We welcome you. away the darkness. You think of the stars in the sky, they are unimaginable distances away and you can still see the light. It's a great symbol of hope. Now Jesus in the Bible is called the light of the world and that is also, well he is a great symbol of hope because sometimes lives can be a dark place but even in those places there's a promise of a light that can shine. It's all the days of God's peace. Shine as a light in the, in the world, world to the, the glory, glory of God, God the Father. Father. It doesn't really make sense that it doesn't just set up. 
congratulations girls for entering God's kingdom and having eternal life. Thank you to all our friends and family for joining us for this very special occasion. Thank you, Reverend Roland, for such a fun service filled with the grace of God. Of the Holy Spirit. After the service, we had loads of photos taken with parents and godparents and grandparents. A lovely picture of our little Livingston family. We took a photo of the Berger family, the four generations. and the Livingston family. A beautiful picture of Princess Tyler and Princess Isla's godparents. We are also proud of our little young ladies. After the service, we went to the Mount to have a celebration of our special day. Come and join me as I give you a sneak peek of how the hall is all decorated and where we're going to have our family and friends celebrate the special day with us.
Come on in and join us for our feast. All our family and friends had a wonderful time celebrating together. Thank you for sharing this special occasion with us. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you on our next video.